Hi everyone and thank you so much for watching. For today's video, I'm going to be sharing with you guys the products I use for my everyday makeup routine. I'm going to be telling you why these are my favorite products and how I use them. So if you want to see what I put all over my face, just keep watching. So the first thing I do before putting anything on my skin is I wash my face. I don't use any specific face wash products. I just use whatever I'm using at the time or whatever I can find laying around my apartment. Then I just dab my face dry with the cloth and I'm ready to go. The first thing I use on my skin is this foundation primer by Laura Mercier. I love this primer because it kind of feels like you're just putting moisturizer on your skin and it's kind of like a layer that goes on your face before you put on any foundation. So I've really, really been loving this foundation primer. The next thing I put on my face after I use the primer is the Silk Cream Foundation by Laura Mercier. The color I am wearing right now is Cashew Beige. I have fallen madly in love with this foundation. I feel like that Proactive commercial that everyone says like, I have the secret, I have the secret, and I want to give the secret away. This is my secret. I'm obsessed with it. I think it covers up any blemishes, any like little zits or acne that I have at the time. I purchased these little mini sponges from Laura Mercier to put on my foundation with and really you can use any sponge that you can find. They sell these at Walgreens and they sell these lots of different places but it was a pack of four for $13 so I figured I might as well just get the sponges while I'm here. So I really love these and what I do is I just kind of dab it into my skin kind of just like all over and I do a little like pea sized amount on my hand. So I just dab it onto my hand and I kind of just put this all over my face all the way down my neck and like up into my ears and into my hairline just so I can evenly get this everywhere. The next thing I do after I put on my foundation is I take this MAC brush and I cannot tell what this brush says but the number is kind of brushed off a little but if you go and ask for this brush it's amazing and I kind of just swirl it on but the product that I use with this is called the Mineralized Skin Finish Natural and a friend of mine recommended this to me at the beginning of the year in August and I just fell in love with it. I swirl my brush onto it and I kind of just swirl this all over my face like this and I really think this is amazing. So what I do after that is I go in with one of my favorite items that I've been using right now and it is called the MAC Prep and Prime and I know they have a couple of colors of this but I'm using the Prep and Prime Highlighter in Radiant Rose. So I'm not a makeup expert, but from what I have learned is you want to highlight all through here, down your nose, in between your eyes, kind of up in this area, and then right above your lip. So that's kind of what I do. The next thing that I do is I go in with bronzer. The bronzer brush that I use is by Eco Tools. It's kind of just one of those like big fat kabuki brushes. And I go in with my Bobbi Brown Golden Light Number no. 1 Bronzing Powder, and I really, really love this powder. It's literally almost gone as you can see, so obviously I liked it. So what I do is I swirl my brush around in here, and I'll just kind of do swirly motions around my entire face, but the areas that I focus the most on are here, the top of my head, and my cheekbones. So, and then also kind of right underneath and down my neck. Right after I do my bronzer, I typically do blush. So right now I'm using this Bare Minerals Bookie Brush. The blush I'm using right now is Bobbi Brown, and it's a super, super bright pink. So what I do is I kind of just tap it on in and tap it on the edge and I just layer it right here along my cheeks and then sometimes I'll put like a tiny bit on my nose and along my forehead. After I finish my face makeup the next step I do is I go to my eyes. So the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna prime my eyelids. So I'm using the Paint Pot by MAC and the color I have is called Painterly and it just has like a screw off lid and it just looks like this and then I tap it all over and I rub it into on top of my eyelid. The brush that I've been using for my base eyeshadow is by Bare Minerals and it's called Eye Defining and Naked Urban Decay like palette and this is just the Naked Number no. 1 palette and I love it. I go in with the color Sin and what I do is I kind of just dip the same light colored brush in and I put this just on the middle lower part of your eyelid. So just on like the eye crease part. Next I'm going to go in with the half baked color. I really like it. So I just take that half baked and I put it right there just on the middle of my eyelid and I think it brightens up my eyes. Next I'm going to now switch brushes. This one is called the eye defining. So this one is a little bit more angled. Normally I dip it into the color buck. I literally just go like this. I've been doing this for so many years. Haven't really switched up my eye makeup routine that it's the exact same thing. And I kind of stop halfway across my eyelid because I don't like it when the inside of my eyelid is dark. I think this makes my eyes like pop more and keeps them awake. 
So the next step I'm going to do is filling in my eyebrows. I don't fill in my eyebrows a whole lot because as you can see they are a lot darker than my natural hair color. So the color that I use to fill in my eyebrows is actually a little bit lighter than my eyebrows. And what I use over top of it is the Great Lash by Maybelline and it's in the color clear. And what I do is I just take this and I'll just go like this over the top of my eyebrows because you kind of just want to keep them in place. So the first one that I go over my eyelashes with when there's nothing on them is called Telescopic Mascara by L'Oreal Paris and this is in the color black. So I pretty much just go over my eyelashes and just do one little layer over top of them. I don't use this one on the bottom. So I have one layer of this on each eye on the top. Next, I'm going to take my next favorite mascara, which is called the Clump Crusher by Lash Blast. So this one, in my opinion, doesn't make your eyelashes super like plump and full, but it does make them clump free. So I do another layer over the top with this one, and I also do this one on the bottom. So I kind of just wiggle it through on the bottom, wiggle it through on the top, and get out all the clumps. The last one that I'm going to use is by Benefit and it's called Bad Gal Lash. I really like this one. This one is not curved, which most of the time I do like the like angled curved brushes, but this one is not, but I think this one does add volume. Thank you so much for watching this video. This is the makeup that I use for my blog photos, my Instagram photos, and I know I've gotten a lot of you asking what makeup I do, if I could do a blog post on it or a video, so that's why I just wanted to show you guys a little bit about each makeup item that I used and why I like it and how I use it. So I really hope that you all enjoyed this video. I will put in the description box below links to everything that I got and where I got it, and hope you guys enjoyed it. Have a good day. Bye.